Whoa, wait a minute, hold up. Whoa, wait. I never heard, I never thought about what he's saying before. He said, those who died are justified for wide. Excuse me. Those who died are justified for wearing the badge. They're the chosen whites. Yo, <laughs> yo, I never thought, I never listened directly to what he was saying. They're the chosen whites. Yo, he talking that shit. Look, wait a minute. Oh my God. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Look. And the thing is, when he called out some of those that work forces are the same that burn crosses. The way I feel is, I remember as a kid hearing the song and being like, I wish it was more explicit with what he's saying. Now that's pretty fun. It's like artistically explicit. Some of those that work for, because it's like work forces. Like as a kid, I'm like, I don't know what work forces mean. I have to imply that, you know, work for, like armed force. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Yeah, 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 but you know, as a kid, I, I get, you know, I'm just saying that burn crunch, that's the explicit shit, you feel me, you know, but killing in the name of, I remember, like, yeah, that's the problem with it, like, it, this, so, this song needs a rap verse, it needs, like, an actual rap verse, because it's like, there's the abstractification, I get what you're saying, and all of the abstract shit, like, killing, and this is what I feel like, this is probably why them dudes, like, uh, whoever the fuck, uh, uh, you know, Ron DeSantis, whoever Republican dude, was able to listen to Rage Against the Machine and not get the message. Because it's like, I feel like, like, it's not that I don't think they're skirting around it, but I think for the sake of artistic expression, they're trying to say things in a cool fucking way, you know what I'm saying? But I think it becomes abstractified in a way where, because, like, like, killing in the name of what? Like, I feel like anyone can hear that and be like, I don't know. We're killing in the name of. I'm just angry. Angry white boy energy. I'm killing in the name of. Like, I feel like it needed to be like, it just needed a rap verse somewhere to be like, this is what the fuck this song is about, motherfuckers. You need to fucking pay attention. You know what I'm saying? Like, now, and, but the thing about it is I can't even act like it. Don't fucking say it. But the thing is, on top of that, I was able to listen to this song for years and not hear the, the, they're the chosen whites. Those who die, they're justified and die. It's like, whoa, whoa. Oh, but the, fuck you, I won't do what you tell me. Like, here's the thing. I love that fucking line. And as that visceral kid type of shit, you know? Oh, yeah, and the previous line. Now you do what they tell you. You know what it's like? It's on a basic, like, I get, that's what it is. I get it on a basic level of I, as a person in the system, am not doing what you tell me. And I feel like it ends up being, is like, because it's not pointed enough, I feel like it allowed all of those white boys, you know what I'm saying, to not really... To skirt by it. But it's so crazy to think about because it's like, the oh, look is... Ah. But again, it's one of those things where it's like, because of it, the thing that they're artistically saying, like, they're not saying, you know, cop killer! They're not saying cop killer! They're saying, those who are di those who died are justified. And recently I mentioned that the cops are also KKK members. So you would make that connection if you know what's going on. You get what I'm trying to say? It's like, it's not that they're not saying it, but it's like abstractified just enough in a way where it's like, I can see people not get it. But look at the same time, it's all fucking smasher. You know what I mean? And fuck it. Maybe may, maybe they deserve to do it that way. Like, God damn it, we want a fucking hit song. And we just, you know, shout theory at motherfuckers. You know, that's not going to be a fucking hit. We got to make it sound cool. You know what I'm saying? So I can't even hate too bad. But anyway, that was my thoughts on the joint, you know. For me personally, of course, the rap critic guy, he wishes that there was a rap verse to really break down the shit and give it to him in a fucking face. But, you know.